let's continue. Desert camp. All right. No break? Do you guys need a break? I don't need a break. I can take a little break, chill and drink water. We got right into it. Onward indeed. I mean, if you guys need to use the restroom or anything, we could take like a mini break. I know that I need to continue in order to do one mission over here. And Jackass asked me to do a mission. I have a lot of side quests. Jackass, I can't deal with your weird hobbies anymore. Look hey, drifting by Jack. stars. What's up? I just started near, so good timing. Oh, hey there. Listen, just ignore that guy. I read this last time. Okay. Oh shit. What? Oh. There we go. Here, follow me. Okay. This is what we agreed to last time. And then I saved before actually following All right, her. see that jerk over there? I need you to get combat data for him. Science will pay you back for this, I promise. Now, fight! Easy peasy. Not you. Oh shit, a level 20? Not bad. Oh man. Oh man, oh man, that was great! Hey, did you know that Android Battle Fever is actually quite similar to the human emotion of love? Wow. So if we want to know what all those old human records are always going on about, all we need to do is let our fists fly. Makes this whole thing feel more romantic, don't you think? I still don't have enough data. I could use some more help. Keep your hands to yourself. Give her a hand. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. So I need you to wipe out those enemies over there without taking any damage. Like, at all. Zero. Zip. Nada. Now it's time to fight. In the name of science. I'm playing this on my PC, same as yesterday. I don't think Nier is even for the Switch. Yes! I love you, your Hagoons. I really do! Just look at all this data. Speaking of your Hagoons, I'm a bit surprised you types are so... intellectual. I thought combat models would be a bit more dense, less thinking, more killing and all that. Frankly, giving you any kind of intellect at all strikes me as pointless. More data? I guess so. 
30 seconds or less? I don't think I can do that. We'll try. Almost there. Oh, we can do it after all. Requested mission completed. With only five seconds left to spare. Holy crispy crap on a stick. Now this is data. Here, look at this. See this reaction? It proves that android brains contain an algorithm which allows them to derive pleasure from battle. Without that, we'd probably stop fighting a long time ago. What a brutally efficient piece of evolution. No worries, Argento. It's possible that this is based on an identical pleasure center in the human brain. Man, those flesh bags really were something. I just need a teensy bit more data. You look like you've got nothing better to do, so give me a hand here. No damage. I don't know if I can do quite that. I don't think I can quite do what she's asking yet. But that's okay. Because we can head forward to find that little sister that's in the desert. yesterday but to my understanding I'm still fairly early on I just got done with the amusement park and the robot village oh I'm just revisiting the desert I've already cleared the desert I'm doing a side quest that involves me revisiting the desert yeah Oh no! Well, I can keep you company until he arrives, Red. Yeah, I'm still pretty early in the game. Leaving the door unlocked at 12 a.m. is bad news indeed. After something like Faith, you never want to leave your door unlocked like that. Too spooky, you never know who will find their way inside. The robot from the village? Uh, Pascal? Is that you? Uh, 9S! Yes, it is me. Many apologies for the sudden transmission. I heard that you were searching for the missing child, yes? Mm -hmm. Well, if you would, please consider this a personal request for myself as well. Go find the child as quickly as you can. She's such a good little girl and so fond of her sister. She's probably somewhere around the desert at the moment. That's where she's likely to find the dented plate her sister needs. Got it. Thank you so much. And please be careful, alright? Interesting. Nines will come find me at 12 a.m. I wish. Dreams of nothing but monsters sneak around your house and fun times, for sure. Nines can protect you from spooky monsters. I believe it. The secret underground passageways? You mean in the desert? I have, thankfully. Cleared them out before I even hit, like, the actual desert zone. Is that...? Monst- not monster, the- Oh, this robot is just crying. 
Hey there, are you the machine who came out looking for a spare part? Huh? Who are you? Your sister asked us to look for you. She did? Really? Really? So, what do you say we had home? Ah, I was so scared! Right. Let's get her back to Pascal's village. How'd you get lost out oh. here anyway? Come on now, don't cry. Did you at least find what you needed? Yeah. She'll be happy, right? I'm sure she will. But I bet she'll be even happier to see you back home safe and sound. Okay. Oh. Do I have to follow her? How did it sniff with no nose? It made the sound of sniffing, I presume. <laughs> the desert. It's just an area that lost all its vegetation due to a lack of <laughs> precipitation. This caused lasting changes in the soil, which means plants aren't able to... Soil? Uh, it's dirt. Ground. The stuff we're walking on? I'm too drunk to pick up this item. Okay, there we go. Oh no! There we go. There we go. Better? Much better. just a force caused by changes in temperature and atmospheric pressure and huh that's actually a hard question now that I think about it <laughs> kind of deep really I mean where does the wind blow from what do you think to be don't know don't care better this way. To be? Can I help here? <laughs> huh? You're the chatty one. Work it out. Oh. Oh. Wow, it's getting late. <laughs> Let's get you home already. That's so funny. <laughs> Such a good dialogue. Do <laughs> you want to know? <laughs> How do they make androids? I don't know. Big oof. A ship. Evade range plus one. Can I take a sip? Hydration is important. I 
realized it would be an escort mission all the way back. Oh, or maybe not. Grumpy lady. Pink ribbon. We should. Grumpy lady, yeah. Exhausting. Yep. That's funny. All right. Check these uh, side quests here. I guess there's something here. I'll put a marker there, just cause. And I guess there's another lady to check out in the desert over there too. <laughs> when a mommy machine and a daddy machine love each other very much. Sure, sure. That all ties back to everything we saw earlier last time we were in the desert. Now if I can figure out <laughs> the bolts and the bees. Yeah, that's what they call it. Okay, just gonna tear through that. And then maybe head this way. fish here too. Just chilling. Good stuff. Upskirt simulator? What's that? Commencing. Whoops. Oh. Complete. I don't want to just start fishing. <laughs> Let's save really quick. Okay. Contact this last lady, that's the end of the Jean Paul missions. You want to be an android? Why is that? it easier than being human. Is it along the same principles of wanting to be a dog? I 
explore much while I was here last time. I'm potentially drifting my stars. I feel like if I were to cosplay someone, it would be A2 because I have friends that do 2B and 9S, but I haven't met 2B in game yet. Or no, sorry, I haven't met A2 in game yet. I've met 2B. <gasps> MGS man, thank you very much for following. Um, so I don't know how A2 actually is, but she's the person I have my eye on cosplay. So we'll see, I have to meet her in game first. Thank you. <laughs> I'm excited to meet her whenever she pops up. It's just on the left. Let's save really quick. Hydration time. music very very much I think it's really good it's different it's definitely got its own style and theme but I think it's really good oh wow there's like a whole ton of them here white machine wait hold on I just want to talk to them free well that's not very nice almost indescribable. I admire him as I do no other. See what, Argento? You have issues. And you clearly lack a discerning eye. I bet men take advantage of you all the time. Not exactly. Ah, right. I found something that Mr. Master Jean-Paul is sure to be interested in. Please take it to him with all speed. Sniffing with no noses? Yeah. Man, I don't know if machines can sniff. Androids hey, can. TV. I've been thinking about something. What? Do you think this fellow is being a little too... <laughs> I don't know, glorified? That's certainly one way to put it. I like how they censored Sean Ball. I think that's funny. Okay, so that's... Everything for the desert. We just, in general, have to go back here. Go to sleep? Okay. Thanks for hanging out, Argento. I appreciate it. Have a good rest of your night. Get lots of good sleeps. I'll see you next time. I'll probably be back. Yeah, I'll be back on Monday. With Monster Hunter Monday. Yeah. 
it'll be great. direction is not that good. So I want to go, where am I right now? Here? Ah, I have to go like all the way up. You're gonna work on cosplays you watch? Nice. What cosplay are you gonna work on? your Byleth cosplay? a Very nice. You know Skate? Ayy! Demon Slayer. I gotta start working on Nezuko soon. I feel very honored that you guys choose to listen to me while you work on cosplay. Oh my gosh. <laughs> That's a funny thought right then though. I can imagine it. Sleep well. Yui, Yui Gahama, thank you very much for following. I don't know how far I have to run. I don't think I can teleport to very many places. It feels less lonely? Oh. I will always be here to keep you company. entirely I like to have stuff playing in the background because otherwise it's like it's a little lonely it's like a little too like empty you know I like having background sounds while I work otherwise the silence itself gets a little like stifling you know Crazy homegirl. Background noise is very nice. Boop. Hydration! That's what Twitch is for, basically. Pretty much. Sleep with the TV on. <laughs> Especially if you're working alone, yeah. I always have to have at least like music or something.
Yes, those are my friends that I've been referencing. They told me if I ever wanted to do A2, they would gladly do, uh, they would bring out their near cosplays. Heading to bed? For sure. SARS! Thank you for the raid! Hello! And sleep well, Ryan. Thanks so much for hanging out for a second day in a row. I appreciate it. It's very kind of you. Good night. Sleep well, homie. If I remember correctly, it's over here. They are really good. Do they buy tickets for the near concert? That's awesome. I'm very tempted to go. It just costs a lot of money to fly all the way out there for a concert, but I feel like it'd be super worth it. They're really sweet people. You'll love them. <laughs> Hello, toasted guest. What's up? I love near. Honestly, it's so good. <laughs> Old nines is running around. I'm just doing some side quests. Nothing like super major. You still have to play it? Oh my gosh. You should totally get it. It's so good. Um, I'm gonna go to Jean Paul first. Let me save. Hawaiian Sniper 808. Thank you very much for following. Oh, not the ladder. Uh, yeah, actually, Jean Paul is like up and down. Good, just tired. Always a mood. <laughs> it's all good. Okay. Hello, Jean Paul. Do you have a moment? Moments are transitory. One cannot possess them. A moment past is a moment lost. A symbol of idle, unrestrained apathy that. Can you please just take this present already? A gift? Let me see. Here you go. Ah, yes. Fascinating. The machine who gave this to us said you were both suspicious and alluring. It seems this so-called gift is nothing more than a piece of unadorned glass. Therefore, I can only surmise that, um, do you want us to bring a message back to the woman who gave this to you? For a mere trifle? No. Okay, then. Let's go. I have another present for you. A present? Of what sort? It's a fossil. One of your followers asked us to deliver it to you. I see, I see. She said you were indescribably passionate when it came to learning, or something like that. A mechanical fossil, no use at all. Do you want us to tell her anything on your behalf, or...? I'll not waste words on mere junk. Junk? This guy's an asshole. Paul doesn't seem to appreciate these presents he's getting. I suppose we should go tell his followers exactly what he thinks of them, huh? We'll be waiting for some kind of reply. Okay, so then I guess that means we have to revisit the ladies from the desert and the park? That's the half of measure. Yep, I guess so. SME Sean Paul, he is uh, a dick to be sure. I wish the alcohol would uh, wear off so I could play more coherently, but alas. I'll just drink more water. I should get more soon. My water bottle's like empty. Could probably get that water bottle ASMR of me rattling it around. Um, but honestly, it's probably easiest to go all the way to the desert. I can't teleport at all, can I? Let's just double check. That's a blue one. 
teleport at least to the desert zone, but I guess not. So, I'm gonna have to run all the way over there. You hate sewing? Oh, What is it about sewing that you don't like? Sewing's my favorite, but I know that everyone has different tastes. And sewing can be pretty difficult if you're more acclimated to doing armor and stuff like that. Here in the checkpoint. Huh. What's the margin of error compared to foam work? see that. I feel like sewing is significantly more complicated than foam work because like with foam work you're working with like you know just one product and it's a matter of like knowing how to geographically translate certain shapes into the shapes that you need and like keeping it nice but I feel like with sewing there's so many different layers into it. So I feel like inherently sewing is a lot more difficult than foam smithing in that sense because it's not the type of thing that you could really just master by doing. You have to do like some research and understanding technology as well, to some degree. I'm glad you agree. take a quick bathroom break so I'll be right back. I'm back. Research on sewing I feel like helps a lot because then you'll know what you need to do but I feel like a lot of it's trial and error as well. And hello Jason Vigil. I have ice cream with me now and some water to help me with that at least a little bit. Okay, continue our truck into the desert. Can I one-handedly eat ice cream? I'm eating one of those hollow top ice creams I figured to explore. I feel like my favorite one of those like novelty brand ice creams is the uh, Magnum, the ones that like encase their chocolate. Like this one was a little bit melted. Whoop. By the time I had to uh, 
by the time I had the opportunity to try it, so. You're wheezing at the faith posts in the Discord? There's faith posts in the Discord? I'm excited to check it out when I'm done streaming. John so much for the second game. But it was nice playing with him again. Music's so good. Boy, pray tell what Master Jean Paul thought of my present. He called it a useless piece of junk. Such cruelty, I have barely the words for it. When I think about his wanton sadism, it makes me. Oh god, ooh. <laughs> Nothing to say to that. Okay. And now we have to make our way to the amusement park. Continuing my one-handed attempts at eating ice cream. And my roommate was stopping by to check on me because I was playing a horror game. Am I vegan? Uh, also, hello, Roysting. Is that a um, combination of Roy Mustang? Uh, I am not vegan. I like eating chicken too much to be vegan, and it's like burgers and stuff. It is! Good taste, homie. I love Full Metal Alchemist. I have a tattoo of the Flamel symbol on my ankle. Oh! You know what I haven't done? My bad. I. Oh. It's already been changed to near. Did I already change it all? Okay. Oh, no, it's just on my ankle, homie. Let me make sure. Ugh. If I could stick my leg up. It's just right here. That's all. I don't think 
like I got banned for showing my ankle on stream. I hope not anyways. so too when I got it done. I feel like a lot of Full Metal Alchemist fans tend to get the uh, Ouroboros tattoo, but I like the Flamel symbol very much. So that's what I got, personally. I'm glad you think it's cool. Ankle ban. Feet too lewd. Can't stream no more. It's okay. I have a chest tattoo that isn't very visible most of the time, but if I wear tank tops, people see it and stuff like that. But I feel like we're feeling that. I can understand if Twitch was a little more wary about stuff like that, but this is just on my ankle. Nice and harmless. <laughs> ankle fetishes? I actually have not heard of ankle fetishes, only foot fetishes. I've been asked on a couple of occasions for feet photos, but never ankle photos. Yeah. <laughs> Someone say, tank tops? Two lewd for me. Three lewd, five me? We're playing something like Nier Automata. Or someone called it Nier Booty Mata, I believe. <laughs> 